Buenos días a todos, yo soy Vanguard de Valor y hoy nosotros vamos a jugar Guacamele. And that's enough Spanish for now. Hello everyone, this is Vanguard of Valor, like I just said, and today we're going to be playing Guacamele. This is a pretty awesome luchador-themed 2D side-scrolling brawler metroidvania game with an awesome luchador theme. We are going to give it a shot and see how it goes, so let's jump into this thing and get to business. Here we go with a new game, let's see what we're up against here. I did play this game a long time ago as part of a stream, but I don't really remember much about it. Juan! Are you home, Juan? Juan, wake up, Juan! I apologize in advance for any terrible accents that are the result of this series. And here we are, I guess we are Juan. A lot of tequila making going on here. Some nice luchador posters. <laughs> Let's get up and see what we're up against in this world. We've got a green block we can't do anything to. Cooking up some tequila, I imagine, here. Let's get outside and see what we're up against. We're finally awake! Noon is upon us! The sun is at its zenith! No time to sleep the day away! The Dia de los Muertos festival is nigh! Take some time to compose yourself. I could use your strong arms in the church once you brush your teeth. Alright. We've got the church in Pueblucho to help Fray Ay Ay Ay. Of course, that's his name. Alright, doesn't look like there's anything else we can do in the house right now, so let's just head over this way. Run through our agave fields. I do like the look of this game, it's pretty cool. We don't have a lot of buttons that do anything right now. I'm guessing because we haven't gotten any powers yet. There's a red block we can't do anything else to, as far as I can tell. Alright, Pueblucho. Here we go. Pueblucho, what do we find? Punchable bears of tequila that give us red dots. What's up here? Hey, Juan! Oh, the luchadors are practicing for the upcoming Dia de los Muertos tournament! I can't let you pass! Alright, I see how it is. Luchadors are apparently pretty important around here. What do we have to say? Juan, I have a fiesta soon! I don't want to be short on tequila! Oh, sorry, Juan, I'd love to invite you, but it's luchadors only! That's nice. What's in here? Hello? It certainly is quiet in the house these days. I just can't bring myself to get rid of our favorite toy, though. So I keep it in the cellar under the stairs. That's sad. You got a luchador toy down there. Let's get out of here. Get up on the roof. Whoop, oh, yeah, we can stand on the landing there. Cool. Hola, Juan. You remember my son, the luchador? He caught three bandits trying to steal holy water from Fry Ay Ay Ay. That's nice. We have Pollo Rojo Tequila. Don't be a chicken. Try it. Lovely. All right. Luchador statue. Yep, luchadors are definitely a big deal around here. The Casa del Pollo. This is the chicken house. It is indeed the chicken house. I wonder if these are like Legend of Zelda chickens. If you make them angry, they summon a swarm of angry chickens to fight you. Doesn't look like it right now, though. These ones are just unhappy at me. Alright. We probably have to come back here later or something. Yeah, I don't see anything we can do here right now. Let's go. We'll come back here later, no doubt. What do you have to say? It's true. I was a real mamacita in the old days. You better believe it. Sure, lady. Lawyer cat versus... Rana Soltero, I think, is... Uh... What's the word? Bachelor frog? <laughs> What's this all about? El Presidente's daughter is not just beautiful, she's also muy inteligente. Didn't you know she has a degree in humanities? Lovely. Alright. Go to the basement here, and we can steal from somebody's house. Cool, we just stole money from somebody. 500 bucks. I hope they don't mind. Let's keep moving. And this is Mega Man versus Link from Majora's Mask. La Mascara versus Mega Hombre. I remember you and El Presidente's daughter would hang out all the time. You haven't spoken in years. Why? I'm sure we'll find out. As a kid? Freya hey, hey, says I'm the best mathlete in town. Can you digit? Oh boy. Alright. The old gas has been abandoned for years. People say that a witch used to live here. True or not, no one wants to live in this house. The Amazing Tequila Brothers. I'm not sure what that's a reference to. They've got crosses on their faces, so they're not Mario Brothers. They're blue and yellow? I don't know. Not sure what that one's a reference to. Oh. Hey Juan, aren't you excited for the festival? I think Fry Ay Ay was looking for you. He was saying he'd help with preparations for this evening. 
Alright, let's go see what he wants then. Some cannons up here. We do have a Day of the Dead festival coming up. No, this is the hoppinest place in town. Hola, Juan. Thanks for coming to help. I'm trying to clear out some space in here. We're expecting people to come from all over for the festival. Even El Presidente's daughter has returned from La Universidad de Santa Luchita. Enough gossip. Could you bust up those empty wine barrels over in the corner? Sure I can. Punch. Got some red dots, too. What strength. I knew you had it in you. El Presidente's daughter always said she saw your potential as well. Such a nice girl, and I'm so glad that El Ambassador's son is out of the picture. Him and El Cabinet Minister's wife. What a scandal. There she is. Hablando del Rey de Roma. Look who appears. Speaking of the King of Rome, apparently. Hello, Frey. I... Juan! Frey asked me to stop by today, but I didn't expect you to be here. Juan, you look so... Remember when we were kids? We used to get in so much trouble together. Wow, that feels like so long ago now. You've really grown up. Anyway, Frey, I found those chairs you were asking about. I'll bring them over later. Juan, could you come by the mansion and help me carry them? I'd really love to spend some time with you. If you want, maybe we could even go to the festival together. I should go. Hope to see you later, Juan. Bye, Frey. Well, we kind of just snubbed her entirely there, but whatever. Hey, Juan, didn't you hear what she said? Now's your chance. Oh, this is better than watching my telenovelas. Soap operas, indeed. Whoa, how many times do I have to tell those kids not to play with fireworks? What was I saying? Yes, that president is daughter. You really should go see her. Some have a feeling that that uh, explosion wasn't just kids playing with fireworks. But let's go see. All right, we know the mansion's over this way, so let's go see what's up. Hey, Juan, what's up? Some chairs for the festival? Sure, I'll just... Ah, that's not good. Hi, Dios mio! That president of this mansion was on fire. Do something, Juan! You could help, you know. All right, let's go in here and try and do something. That's definitely a mansion on fire. A mansion del presidente. I love the music in this game. It's so good. I play it on stream all the time, so people who watch the stream probably know. Ooh. Oh, so someone is trying to play hero. You are far from the fields, Agave boy. This is no place for you. Juan, run now, before this ugly skeleton gets you too. Oh, your head's on fire. Hello. <laughs> what do we have here? I sure wouldn't mind melting those eyes off your skull. Gran Galaka, it would be my pleasure to trigger this intruder. Leave this one to me, flame face. I could use a bit of action today. Silencio! If Jaguar Javier were here, he could be trusted to handle this. Unfortunately, he is occupied. I'll get rid of this puny Himador myself. The living world may have chosen to forget me once, but I won't give them a choice this time. I'm Carlos Galaka, ruler of the dead world, and you... You're not even a luchador. Prepare to die. <laughs> Versus Carlos Calaca, special guest, Presidente's daughter. Oop, well, that didn't go well. Juan, no! Well, that was uh, not much of a fight there, was it? <laughs> it looks like we're dead. This does not look like a happy living jump in place. Can I go over this way? Is anything up here? Doesn't look like it. Alright. Let's boogie. There's definitely a chest up there. I don't think I can double jump or anything to get it though. Hmm. I don't have any abilities. Uh, okay, let's move on then. What do we see here? Pueblucho. El Presidente. Hmm. Viva Calaca! Calaca for mayor! More green blocks we can't do anything to? Okay. I'm guessing we'll get power to attack these blocks later. What is all this about? This place is a mess. It is the city of the dead, though, I suppose. Ooh, a luchador mask. Definitely shiny. Who are you? Greetings, Juan. I am Tostada, guardian of the mask. How interesting that the mask has revealed itself to you. Kalaka has thrown the universe out of order. You must have some role to play. If you put this mask on, Juan, its power will bring you back to the world of the living. Are you ready? 
I guess so. Here we go. Twing! And is this a magical girl transformation? <laughs> yes, it is. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, we just magical girl transformed into a luchador, Sailor Moon style. Fantastic. <laughs> We're back in the land of living. Okay. Psst, luchador, over here. The town is under attack by evil skeletons. They've locked everybody in the church, and I fear they intend to burn it to the ground. Please save us. Before you go, though, a tip: if you ever want to check your current objective, hit select. Now, please go save the town. I'll keep pretending to be a barrel. Well, that's cool. We can go second player, but obviously I'm playing this by myself, so that's not an option. Let's go save those people. Get back, you fiend! Help! Help! You there, Luchador! Save me from this Esqueleto! How? Oh, he jumped down, okay. Punch him up. That's right, Luchador! Left hook, right hook, shoot his boss! Oh, I can grab him with Y and throw him! There we go, that worked out pretty well. Thank you, my son, but we aren't safe yet. They've locked all the townsfolk in the water closet. Help us! We're scared! And it smells gross in here! Ay ay ay, here they come! Take them down! Those gutless skeletons got nothing! They definitely have guts, they're skeletons. Alright. And you can throw them into each other, even better. Aerial combo into the ceiling, yeah! That's awesome, that's actually pretty satisfying. Don't let it hit you, Lichador! Roll into the end of its swipe attack! No, oh, it took damage, whoops. Okay, so you can roll to dodge damage. That's good to know. Whoa, this one's fast! Don't forget to dodge its attacks! Oh, lots of missing happening here. Ooh, that looks like it hurt. Can't grab him yet. Now we can. Smash him into the floor. Beat him up some more. Oh, he's fast. He's definitely tougher than the other guys. Okay. So yellow one's gonna be a bit trickier. There we go. We got him, though. Ah, at last we're safe. You've saved the day! Now please, free the townsfolk from the water closet! Okay. Help! Let us out of here! Done and done. I can't thank you enough for what you've done here today, Luchador. Still, I worry for the safety of El Presidente and his family. Look for clues in Santa Luchita. I think some of the evil Esqueletos were headed that way. Godspeed, Luchador. The world is in need of your help. Alright, so I guess we have to go to another city now. But, oh, what do you want? Huh. The way you dealt with those skeletons was magnifico. Perhaps you could help me with a small problem of mine. My home has become overrun with chickens. I don't know how, but they escaped from their pen. Do whatever it takes, just get them back into the pen. Punch them, throw them. It's okay, my chickens are the toughest around. All right, I guess that's Castle del Pollo then. Let's go down here and see what we have to do over here. Is that cage open now? Yes, it is. Okay, so I guess we just have to chase the chickens into the cage. Get over there, chickens. That way. That way. All right, throwing the chickens, I'm guessing, is for these ones because otherwise they're going to be hard to get up out of that pit. These guys go up the stairs on their own? Yes, they will. Cool. All right, let's get down here then, beat up these chickens, get them over to that pen, and see what we get for it. Hopefully we get a nice little reward for our trouble. Up you go, chicken. Nope, nope, up, up. Ah, beat him up some more. Guess there's no penalty for attacking the chickens, though, otherwise they probably would have given it to us by now. All right, over to the pen, chickens. Get over there. Perfect. Locked him in. <laughs> Awesome. I guess we go back and talk to the guy, turn in our quest. There he is. Gracias, senor. Finally, order is restored to mi casa. Here, I know some of the skeletons that came through town dropped this. Hopefully it's of use to you. Some dots. Ooh, looks like it's a piece of heart. Excellent. Thank you. Muchos gracias, senor. What's this all about? Hello? Hola, new mysterious papacito. Alright, so she's now attracted to me because I'm a luchador. Lovely. Whee! Nothing over here, I guess. Are these people gonna say the same things? I don't know. These old gas has been abandoned for years. Yep, that's the same. What about you? Yeah, same dialogue. Anybody else have anything different to say? Thanks for saving us. Uh, no problem, lady. Gracias for saving the town. No problem. Can I do anything else in this house now? Probably not. I don't know how to get in that hole in the floor on the right. We can. We have to have a roll. We do have a roll. Probably not enough to get in that hole, though. I should go try it, though. Just, to, just in case. Can we get in that hole as a rolling person? No. Okay. Fair enough. Our dodge roll does not let us do that. 
Can I dodge in the air? Oh, you can. That's cool. Is the mask still on him? Yes, it is. Anything different in here? This looks the same to me. We're not going to talk to these guys again. We're just going to boogie out of here. All right, let's go to the forest. Let's see if there's anything exciting waiting for us over here. Can I break this? No, we still can't. Look at all those uh, Day of the Dead things. Fantastic. Ooh, what's this? Looks like it's a checkpoint. What up, man, bro? You want the stuffs? Because I got the stuffs. We've got abilities. Alright, we've got three attacks here. Suplex, Das Boot, and Pile Driver. Huh. We have Stun Boost, which means it's easier to throw people. Okay. Respawn Boost, which doesn't affect us at all. Stamina Regen... Stamina delay, health regen, stamina, and health chunks. Okay, so these are pieces of heart and pieces of stamina, I guess. And these ones are all speed ups. Okay, that sounds interesting. Actually, I should check the other thing. What about costumes? Does it do anything? Costumes. It seems to. We can be the luchador, which gives us bonus charisma, and a discount at Hernando's, which I don't know actually does anything. We could be the chicken, which gives us health regeneration. Okay, but less stamina regeneration. Juanita gives us stronger punches and kicks, but shorter throws. Infinite stamina for the skeleton. Super powerful throws for the El Portero. He's a goalie, apparently. Lovely. He doesn't have strong melee attacks, though, which is interesting. Alebrije deals massive damage, but takes massive damage. Diablo's suit gives you... Oh, life-stealing. Interesting. Less overall health, though. Huh. Interesting. Some cool stuff here. Some different colors as well. Wow, all kinds of different costumes for different people. Cool. All right, well, that might be interesting once we have some more money to spend. Let's go, though. We have to explore this forest. What do we have here? Ooh, that was interesting. The game kind of blinked out of existence there for a second. It might have crashed. All right, I'm not exactly sure what happened there, but I think we're back after the crash. This should be on the other side of that, uh, that wall right there, so let's just keep moving. Where Blue Joe is behind us. Time to move on. Skeletons! All right, let's blast our way through these guys and see what lies in this side of the horizon. Dead skeletons, apparently. Ooh. Oh, didn't mean to do that. I'm gonna grab them. Didn't work at all. Whoop! Wanna make sure we don't take any damage here if we can help it. We should get our health back pretty quick from these guys. At least from the red. Looks like it regenerates a little bit when you kill enemies, too. All right, this guy's a raged enemy. He basically throws bones at us. Oh, you get a bit of health from them as well when you kill things. Okay, that's why. We don't just regenerate health, they drop health. Okay, makes sense. Throw you at each other. Lovely combo there, fantastic. Red block you can't do anything to. Let's keep moving. Hello there, skeleton. You're dead. Green block we can't do anything to. Okay, let's move on. Oh, hello. I guess you're Jaguar Javier. Stop right there, luchador. Orders of Carlos Calaca. I warn you, take one more step and it will be your demise. What's that? You want to know who I am? Hm, you seem like an honorable luchador, so I will answer your question. My name is Jaguar Javier. I was once human like you. In my youth, I live and trained in these very woods. I became a mythical warrior, serving noble kings and leading great armies to victory. But that was a long time ago. Now I serve Kalaka. The final days of Earth are upon us. I suggest you return home and spend them with the ones you love. Hmm, so stubborn this one. Luchador, you saved the church, an admirable and heroic feat, but your journey ends here. It pains me to so unceremoniously dispatch a warrior such as yourself, but you can't say I didn't warn you. Okay, he's powerful. And there goes the bridge. Thankfully, none of that debris hurt us, nor did the fall. Cool. All right, checkpoint. Let's go to the left first. Whoop. All right, floating platforms over acid. Lovely. What's over this side? Ooh, a chest. Boink. With a yellow pixel in it. Which I'm guessing is a stamina point, since the heart was a piece of heart. And we know that... Oop. Okay, it doesn't kill you. It doesn't even hurt you. It just teleports you back. That's interesting. Okay. Let's get out of here, then. Whoop! Let's go, Juan. Leave no stone unturned as we search for all the collectibles. We could probably afford to buy something from that thing now, but we'll wait for now. Whoop! More skeletons! Alright, beat our way through these guys. Whoops! 
You, sir, need to stop fighting. There we go. Looks like the coins come to you from any distance, too, which is nice. Can't get up there. Okay. Down this way we go, then. Whoop. Checkpoint. Little, oh, tap. No, little tap, okay. There we go. A, you're a giant chicken. <laughs> okay. Let's talk to the giant chicken. Hey, dude! Use left trigger or right stick to roll to spikes. It's awesome sauce. Okay, giant chicken. I'm not going to question your wisdom. Aerial dodge. Sweet. All right. Let's get up here. Whoop. There we go. This looks like an arena, which it in fact is. Okay. Let's beat up some skeletons then. Next. Hello, skeleton. You're done. Oh, and I jumped right into a bone. Cool. All right, well, that was silly. He just took that bone out of his own rib cage. That's an interesting way to fight. Smash you to the floor. There we go. More. Bring me more enemies. I ran straight into more damage. I'm not doing a very good job of avoiding hits here. Ooh, that'll get hurt. All right, there we go. Defeated. That'll get us some more loot. Fantastic. Let's keep going. What do we have up here? Long ladder. Red block up there. Checkpoint here. Whoop. Lots of spikes to jump through. And those are definitely Metroids, aren't they? They look like Metroids. What's in here? More Metroids. A house we can go in and loot from. Money, I'll take it. A goat and a Chozo statue. I guess Metroidvania really was an apt description for this. Got ourselves a power-up, I guess. What? You crazy luchador! Why you gotta go and break my Chuzo statue? I caramba, man, I've only got like 15 of those things left. Typical luchador, punch first and ask questions never. And he's a man now, okay. Behold, I am the Great Wei Chivo, Lord of all man goats, warrior trainer extraordinaire, and king of awkward punishments. <laughs> now, before we begin, tell me, is your mother single? Does she have a type? Does she like bad boys? Oh, the terrible jokes. Ahem, okay then. Explain to me how you got here, and don't skip out on anything. Especially on how you got that mask. Alright, time skip. Talaka, the temple, El Presidente's daughter, and Jaguar Javier, my former student. Hmm. I'll just have to ask your mother out after we save the world. First, we must train you in the arts of a true luchador. The statue you just broke contained a magical power, the rooster uppercut. Press left and up left and B to perform this powerful move. This move can break red blocks and can be even performed in the air. But be careful, if you use it too much, you'll tire yourself out for a while. Alright, so we have a stamina bar then, I guess, which is going to use those powers. You work on that move, kiddo. If it doesn't kill you, then we'll continue your training next time we meet. Rooster uppercut! Alright. Ooh, that's pretty sweet. Ooh, can I get up here too? Ooh! What's up here? That was unexpected. Huh. A piece of heart. I will take it. Thank you very much there, game. I guess exploring pays off. I didn't really think there'd be anything up there. Alright. Cool. Alright, well, I guess we can smash our way through this now. Yes! We can break our way through red blocks, no problem. I could actually go back, too. Let's go back and see what's in those earlier air... Oh, I can't go back, can I? Oh, I can. Cool. There's some red blocks over here we could potentially break. Let's see if there's any more loots to be had. Where's this? I'm confused now as to where I'm going. I have no idea if I'm going in the right direction or not, because I know I went off the beaten path. There's a chest here, though, so that's probably good news. There's some money. Do we have a map? We do. Oh! Oh, interesting. This connects over here. We might have been supposed to come here anyway, then. Can I get through here? Oh, there's a wall in the way. Okay, I guess we're not supposed to go this way yet. That's interesting, though. So if we go... Hang on, if we go back, are we supposed to come down through here before? I gotta go double-check. It looks like we were actually supposed to just go over this. 
Ah, yes, because there's a blue block there I can't do anything to. Okay, so instead of going up, let's go back down this way quickly and check out the items down here. We're probably going to end the episode soon. Now that we've got that rooster uppercut, seems like as good a time as any. But I do want to come back here and double check those red block things we saw back at the beginning. Because there were a couple of them back here. Hello again, rooster. Oh, he's just said the same information. Ow, that didn't work as planned. Ugh. Oop. There we go. There was a red block over here somewhere. Oh, we can jump up to here, too. Oh, or can we? Hmm. Can I not jump that high? Oh, come on. So close. There was a red block back here. We'll go check that out and see if it has any more free loot for us. No, we can't get back to that either, because of this thing. Alright, well, I guess I was just mistaken. Surprisingly enough, you can't make either of those areas. Can I double jump? Can I triple jump, rather? Can I do this again? Now I'm exhausted, so I can't now. One more quick experiment, and we're probably gonna end the episode there. Nope, you cannot rooster uppercut again until after you've hit the ground. Okay, we're gonna head back over to where we just were by that staircase. And we're probably gonna end the episode there for now. So, thank you for watching, everyone. This has been Vanguard of Valor playing some guacamelee for you today. If you've enjoyed the episode, don't forget to let me know what you thought about it in the comments below, because I'm looking forward to trying some different things, and this should be fun. Anyhow, I uh, will see you in the next time. For now, bye-bye.